Corsic, uh, Sardinia is actually part of Italy, but they want you to fly their flag. So we have to put up their flag. Which is like this. We don't even know what their national anthem is, so we just go da 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 da. Here are two crazies from South Africa. That is Frick and Pietru. We decided to chuck everything and now we are living and sailing full time on our new home, Sisu. So we managed to switch our engines off and we are sailing. of him than try to go at the back and I'm not sure whether this mono will realize that this guy has a, a net out that mono will definitely is busy overtaking us the sun sail and the sails is not even nicely trimmed looks like a 51 foot bow okay Christian is 51 no wonder that thing can go so fast. Look at this restaurant. All you can see is that little balcony type thing. And people standing there. I can just imagine what it looks like inside. What cool is this? This is the entrance to where we're gonna work. This looks like the dinosaur era. The wall. And this is a narrow little entrance. What a hideaway for a gunner. You can hardly see him. Well, you could hardly see him at that age stage. This is just so different. A friend that recommended this place to us from Ikigai, Paul and Kirsten said, it ain't like anything you've seen before. And that is the honest truth. Look at that. So we managed to do shorelines, stern to, like all this other boat here, and look at this cute bloody place. And then you get also <laughs> big as fairies. Just making a U-turn in this small space here. So we managed to get help from our friends from Proud. Proud cat. Proud cat. We saw them last in Turkey. And now we in France <laughs> and we see them again. And there is Old Town or the start of Old Town. So we will very soon going into Old Town. Oh, cannot wait. It looks so damn bloody cool. And there is even a small beach. <laughs> Look at that. It's just like amazing. Okay, so the boys are out helping the fellow yatties. It's been, I think, their third attempt at coming in next to us. Shame, man. But, but this is such an awesome little cute bay. And just the two of them on the boat, the lady tried to pick up the mouse line in the front there, but it just wouldn't work. And apparently some of these mouse lines 
either you it's a miss and miss and run or miss and eat eat and run kind of thing so you pick it up and there might be something at the end of it or it just might amount to nothing so Frick is now feeding it let's see if it's gonna work if it doesn't end into nothing this prowl said yeah, yeah. The, the the guy they try to help the friends board and Hopefully we we help them. <laughs> <laughs> Did that just be super helpful? <laughs> and they've got the experience to tell us. Yeah. You pick up a line, but it's not guaranteed that there is something at the end of the line. It might just amount to nothing. I hope the line's not broken. Eh? Yeah. They actually picked our lines up before we got here, which is super amazing. Oh, these are. Uh oh. Also a broken line. <laughs> it's tied together. Ooh. Okay, let's try another line. You haul and you haul and you haul and then you get to nothing. Oh, success at last. Shame. So maybe we're going to have French food tonight. Maybe we invited over for a French meal <laughs> on the French boat. And you want to have French food? <laughs> Bow, bow, bow. There we go. There we go. Stern light. This lady knows how to do it. Oh, they've got gloves on. They know how to do it. Oh, they've been very clever. Nay, Mr. Deep. And that's just stern lines. Oh, there we go. And that, folks, is how you do stern do in a spot where there's no marineros. <laughs> Thankfully, there are fellow yatis to help you out. <laughs> And they charge you 25 euros for it. 50. And if you're on a catamaran, they charge you 50 euros because you've got two holes. That is just not fair. <laughs> Mr. Lagoon and Mr. Leopard coming to the rescue. <laughs> it's good. You've got a workable key again. <laughs> Lock. <laughs> And the pix is over here. Already ready. We're gonna go climb the big. I think that was the original entrance to Bonifacio. The original entrance to the city. Lots of stairs. So I'm gonna get my exercise in again today, my 10,000 steps. Showed me your affection, but I was looking for perfection. So I moved on and on and on to someone new, as if no one knew what I was going through. I know you think I'm just pretending, and that I can't rewrite the end. Isn't how you find the one that I am through with playing games. Okay. Oh my goodness. I need to. It's left here. Yes. This is a cream with uh, alcohol. And yes, also. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Little dungeon. This looks like sprinkles. <laughs> what, what are the flavors? What flavor? Hello. Uh, banana. Banana, citrus, 
chestnut, coffee, coffee, euh, lemon, ah. euh, pistachio. Oh, pistachio. Ouais. And watermelon. Watermelon. Yes. Oh, that should be interesting. Guys, yeah. I yes. smell it. it this morning like I was uh, working on the Myrtus. Uh, what? Sure. Uh, this is a Corsican Bay. This is uh, about this. Oh, like berries. Oh, I like berries. It's not juniper. It's not juniper berries. Uh, oh, maybe. What is these things? Ju ju juniper? Uh, no, Myrte. Myrte? Yes. Of course. Uh, The most, uh, the most uh, new uh, uh. Corsican liqueur. If you want sure. to taste. What is right. it? Just taste, tell me. And that's alcohol? Yes. <laughs> I feel like Oblix. Bonjour. <laughs> <laughs> magic. Magic potion. Et vous pouvez même goûter si j'aime pas le vin, alors je veux. On n'a pas que ça. Mais l'endroit est excellent. And? What does it taste like? J'adore. I have no idea. Ça c'est de la liqueur de vin. Just small bit, small, small, small. Almost like black currant or something. Ah. Ça, c'est les baies de miel que j'ai sorti avant-hier de l'alcool. Ouais. Ouais, on les conditionné, après on les revend au restaurant pour euh, les sauter de veau, les cibles sanguinées et tout ça. Il ouais. n'y <rire> a rien qui se perd. C'est bien. 1904. Yo. And I'm already sweating because it's a lot of steps. It's 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 a lot of steps for me. That's a lot of steps. It was about a hundred. No, cannot be. Not close to much. Wait, one thousand four hundred the other day. No, it's not hundred. It was like hundred thousand. No, it must be a hundred thousand. I knew you were gonna say it's a thousand. But yeah, so we stopped for a beer. So cheers, guys. And then there's even cars here. <laughs> no. Are you going around the corner? No. Please! My golly gosh! Frickin' goodness! <laughs> Apparently he has done this before. <laughs> like. Petro. 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 Yeah. Not Pietro, Petro. Petro. It's actually Pietro, but everyone says 
Petro. Petra. 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 This is Petra. So sit down. Where are we going to have a beer? Wow! We have a night. Like the complete night. So we we discovered this this sweet shop and it is like just goes on and on. <laughs> Did you guys come up here? Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> so we are about to descend a couple of million steps. Look at this table. Who is that? We got an exercise. We got an exercise on a corner door like this, but it's ancient part, which is broken. Oh no. Oh no. You came from the bottom? Si, si, si. Uh. From the bottom. Okay. We need to go down. Down. Ooh. Look at this. Mm. We're going down, down, down. More steps. Oh, look at this. We've got like shooting holes here. Mm. And sorry, sorry, the GoPro cannot fit through there. And look, there is Sisu. Yo, it's a garbage shoe. Are we going? Are we going to manage to go down? Well, you can go that way for a minute and take a shot. <laughs> for a minute. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Yo, yo, yo! Like we're going. <laughs> eh? Eh? Where are we going? Down. Uh, you're not ready. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm just focusing on that. Look at that. Yo. Go, go, go. So we are planning. So that is Italy. This is Portugal and Spain, France, 
and there's Greece and here's Africa. So we are like in the middle, middle, middle of the Mediterranean. We are somewhere there. And we want to sail from here. From there we want to sail to Monaco. Monaco. So we want to sail to Monaco and explore that coast over there before we will head over to the Balearic. So we need to check now the weather and we've been checking the weather now for, for a couple of days because it's getting pretty interesting. We need to get a weather window to cross because this will take uh, a day, a night and a day. It's 150 miles, so it's one 24 hour day. Um, but yeah, you start in the morning and you arrive the morning there and then <laughs> you're very tired. So we need to find a time to go from here to there. So this might be an opportunity. There's very light winds. Here, now it's better. So that's Wednesday morning, or Wednesday afternoon already, like very light. So we can start going and we can get a nice wind from this, from 120 degrees from our back and we can get to Monaco. But now it looks like we need to start going on Thursday, not anymore on Wednesday. But look at Friday. So when we arrive there, it's going to getting really, really interesting. So we need to find the shelter because that blow is going to be serious. Now there is a little bit of shelter there. If you can look at the coastline, there's this. But look this. So we cannot cross now. Um, this, this, let us see what, 36 knots. Let's go a little bit back. 39 knots. Yeah, so that is that is serious stuff. That if we go down, yeah, it will be from 180, uh, 120 degrees. If you look at this, but it will be very short waves, so it will be <laughs> incredibly nasty. Now we can start thinking of going, and that is on Sunday. So we need to go on Wednesday, explore there, and on Sunday then go down. And that is how you select window weather windows. And weather windows is actually then now also determining our the length of our stay. Because now here, yeah, we have to stay in this place here. And it's a beautiful place, look. It's very nice, very beautiful. So we can stay here and enjoy this. But there's places to see and places to go. <laughs> <laughs> so we and, and we only have limited time to be in the Met. We need to get to out out of EU before our visa run out. So we need to rush out to get that and in the weather it's getting more and more shitty, right? Mm. I think it's getting really, really like these blows that you just saw, it's getting more and more ugly. So we need to get out <laughs> of the Met and get to the Canaries. So that is also a Russian thing. Oh, we need to stop at a couple of places. <laughs> yep, and this is a nice place. Let's go explore. Yeah, we need